I think my favorite part of the school is probably the environment. It's very friendly. The teachers try to make it as positive as it can be. The teachers really try to push you to be your best and it's different from any other high school. So now what I'd like for you to do is open up to page 168. I really like this high school because first of all, I heard that everybody was nice here. It was small and so I wanted to find the smallest high school possible where I could know all the teachers and be able to interact with everybody. Your goggles need to be on. Today you're burning your magnesium in the crucible. A lot of the classes in this school are already kind of set in that college-ish setting. Like I hear a lot of teachers saying, this is how they do it in college. Uh, I hear that a lot. And so by the time you go to 11th grade and 12th grade, you'll have that prior knowledge. All right, so come back, have a seat. Putting first things first. A lot of the classes, sometimes you'll have a bumpy start and then um, you'll quickly figure out, you know, the works and then when you start getting um, the grades that, you know, reflect your hard work, it feels really rewarding. So on page 168, there's more than five listening styles and I'll show you where they are. Sometimes tests are all on the same day <laughs> and the day before that is usually uh, a challenge. While being challenged educationally and coming here, I feel that I have definitely fought through different circumstances that have not only grown me as a student, but grown me as a person. Since it's a smaller school, all the students mainly have the same teachers. So if we're struggling, we might ask one of our friends, hey, can we FaceTime? Can we work on this assignment? And we're all very supportive and the teachers as well. The teachers will do literally anything to help you. If I'm struggling in math and I go up to my math teacher and I'm like, I really don't understand this. I really would like some help. Miss Nolan or even Mr. Nielsen would be like, when can I set up a Zoom? When can I help you after school? When do you have a free period that I can maybe help you? For me, the importance of being dual enrolled is the chance to get a head start on my career and be educationally advanced, rather than kids from other high schools who have to spend an extra two years in college. Doing the work now is going to ultimately help me and my peers in the future. That little extra work that might feel like a pain, in the long run, it's gonna help you out at the college and future colleges.